Hey, babe, what you doing? Hey, I am shopping guns and ammo on sportsmansguide.com. All right, let's see what we got. Yeah, buy as many guns as you want. You're my guy. Oh, thanks, baby. I bet Miss Poet, my, my coupon code's not working. Wait, what? I said my coupon code's not working. Well, what did we do? Ah! Baby, what's wrong? Is my coupon code working? Yes. And I can have all the guns I want? No, we're on a budget. Yep. What is going on? <laughs> Get down on the ground. There's a gunman behind him. All right, hey, it's okay. I'm terrified of being flanked in the darkness. And I gotta get away from these lights or I'm gonna die. And I'm breaking contact here. All right, what's happening folks? Got a special treat today. I'm joined by my buddy, Michael. Michael, say hello to these people. Hello. Yo, man, you just nailed that. It was the Spartan beard, turned sideways. Look at the profile on it, look at that. I just trimmed mine, I feel so emasculated next to you. Way to go with that. Appreciate it. So yeah, anyway, uh, Michael works at the Firearms Training Academy and they have this baller simulator right here. Uh, so it's got three different panels, kind of wraps around. And the thing I love about simulators is it lets you get a lot of experience through, you know, going through all these different scenarios. So see fast, think fast, holy cow. There's just no better way to get this type training. Maybe this is the only way to get that type training, but it's just cheap quick experience. I say cheap. This system isn't cheap. You can't like go get this, uh, but it's awesome. And I'm about to run through a whole bunch of scenarios that Michael's going to have for you. Michael, tell us a little bit about this scenario. Which scenario? This, I'm sorry, the simulator. <laughs> Shut up. You know what I meant. I'm just, I'm bad at talking. Gotcha. Gotcha. Well, the, the simulator is designed, you know, as you said earlier, to see fast and think fast. For those that haven't trained, either it's the military or law enforcement, uh, that civilian population that just doesn't understand that, that the battle thought process. And so what we're able to do is to build on fundamentals, the basics of marksmanship, and then into movement, and then into the mindset of the battle, and how to think through that process when you're in, in the fight. And so, again, it's uh, seeing fast, thinking fast, and this, what this system does is help build that so that you can think clear down the road and also um, when, when it comes to engaging targets, making sure that your shots are accurate and accounted for. Very good, very good. Now, a lot of people aren't going to be able to have access to this facility unless you live in the southeast. This is kind of worth a road trip for, but in the southeast, we're in what? Where are we? Cherokee County. Cherokee County. Yes. Uh, so anyway, if you're in north... Northern Georgia? North, North Georgia. North Georgia, right above Atlanta. You can check these guys out. Be in this room and play with this simulator. I'll have links below uh, in the description if you want to get in touch with these guys. If you're not in the southeast, you need to find some type of uh, simulator somewhere around the country. There will be some place relatively close to you, but you've got to engage in this training. Really important. I love it. And you'll see me kind of fail forward. I'll do well on some scenarios and other ones I just won't do as well. Mike's laughing because he's going to think it's funny to see me fail. Uh, but, um, yeah, anyway, hey, uh, what type of scenarios are these? You were talking uh, before about these are taken from what? But, yeah, all the scenarios that we have, which is over 300 different types of scenarios, are taken from actual um, reports from law enforcement agencies where whether it was a, a murder, um, a suicide, or just actual law enforcement engagement um, activities, and then they are recreated um, in order, each scenario has multiple outcomes, so uh, they're all designed for decompliance. Um, uh, we can escalate the situation in order if, if the, the trainee or the client isn't really responding well verbally uh, or tactically. So, so you'll be the uh, 
Wizard of Oz behind the curtain, exactly screwing with me yes. at your little computer. Yes, absolutely. people are like, how about this curveball, John? Exactly, such a punk. Yes, yes, such a punk. Try to keep you uh, on your toes. This is really good for hey, just civilians. Uh, this is really good for cops. A lot of these scenarios are for law enforcement, right? Yes. Uh, and then uh, there's even some military scenarios in this one, right? Yes. Anyway, if you can't, if you're not in the southeast, you can't check this one out. Find something in your area. It's worth traveling for. It's really, really good training you cannot get on the flat range, right? So anyway, we're going to jump in. Mike's going to run me through this stuff, and we'll see how we do. Here we go. Go, how's it going? Okay. Give me the perfect beat. So when you see a single screen like this, this is just setting the stage for you. When all three screens come into play, then you'll be able to interact. Hey man, can I help you? Hey, I'm sorry to bother you, but I was wondering if you could spare some cash. Don't have any, so sorry. Have a good day. Oh, come on. I just need a little help right now, okay? Just I'm whatever gone. you have. Whatever you have. I'm gone. Oh, I'm, come on. You I'm, know you can I'm afford around it. the corner. You look like you can afford it. I'm way gone. <laughs> Don't make this difficult, okay? Easy, Do buddy. not make this difficult. Okay, goodbye. I'm running. Now I'm running away. Literally I need running. I right now, okay? Hurry up. Come on. Give me what you got. Literally running. Something. <laughs> I win. I'm gone. <laughs> Literally running <laughs> to save his life. <laughs> Easy, bud. Hey. Hey, bud. Can I help? Whoa. Hey, come on out, bud. But it's all right. It's all right. Whoa. Yo. I am super dead. Okay, well, I am dead. Like two different ways. <laughs> so.
I'm a concealed carrier. Yep. Tennis match just finished. Yes. And we're rolling. And yes. Let's do it. So what we can give you, what we use this for is, he started at 21 feet, so this is to set up that the 21 foot rule, so yeah, to speak. Sure. So he's got within eight feet and seven inches to you. Your shot placement was really good. Um, and your movement off of the X obviously was perfect. Um, so it gave you plenty of space. Um, his time of movement, his first reaction to you was one second. You dropped him at 2.7. And so that gave you probably a reaction time of about one second on the target. Okay, you're at a bike, bike store, just shopping for some bikes for you and the family, and this happens. How can we help you today? in, Uber dropped you off, you're getting ready to walk into mom and dad's house. Zebra, 210. Shit. So, come on. Come on, man, put him down. Lay down on the ground. Quiet, 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 quiet. Where is he? Where is he? Help me, God! Help me! Oh! Oh! I don't like how I'm clearing rooms. Please! Don't! I'm sorry! I'll give it back to you! You can have anything! Please don't kill me! You don't know how to do it! Here, I'd be cutting the pie. On suspect two, I forgot he was wearing body armor and had to stitch up to the head. Where is she? I don't think she's working today. I haven't seen her at all. I go really back there. Hard to come out here. Want me to go back there myself? No, no. I can get the manager. Hey, bro. Fuck the manager. Go back there and bring her out here. Hey, bud. Can I help? Women are crazy, you know. Hey, why don't you go get her real quick and we'll have a chat right here. Hey, bud. Hey, no, no, it's it's cool. All's cool. You have responded to a call of a silent alarm at a commercial business. You are currently conducting a building search. I must be a cop. Yes. Hey, get the fuck back. what do you want? John Farnham says, ask what you want, and they'll lean out and tell you. <laughs> and then you're at the wall. Yeah, good night, sweet prince. Open the goddamn seat! I can't! 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 I
Oh. <laughs> Suplex, fight over gun. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you're right on that one. You're in a movie theater. Movie theater. Oh, get down, get down! All right, easy, everybody get out. All right, everybody slowly walk toward me. Stay low. Very excited to be at this movie. This is Mona Lisa's smile. Everyone okay? Right. Calling it in, requesting backup. Wondering why he has not stopped. Getting angry he has not stopped. Tingly spider sense going off. No dispares! No dispares! No te go! No, okay. no, no, dispares! No dispares, por favor, no dispares! No hice nada! It's okay. No hacer, Calm no down. No, 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 cálmate, cálmate, cálmate. Calm down. All right, let me have you slowly. No. Okay. Uh, I'm hitting the tree line now. <laughs> Get down on the ground. There's a gunman behind him. All right, hey, it's okay. I'm terrified I'm being flanked in the darkness. And I gotta get away from these lights or I'm gonna die. And I'm breaking contact here. I'm calling it in. All right, I am responding to an officer who pulled someone over and hasn't checked in. There's his vehicle. I'm calling it in. Vehicles all seem to be abandoned. Someone's behind the ve under the vehicle. Uh oh, you need to back way up. Back way up. Tell them to come out. Don't go around the car. Good night. Uh, not a very, there you go. Yeah. All right. Hey. Hey, what's up? What's happening here? Hey, no sweat. What do you want? Hey, right, bud, can I help you? He's got a gun. Hey, this guy's a fucking drug dealer. Be careful. I live right down the street here. here. I live right here. Where's it coming from? Get back! Get back! I'm killing her! I'm killing her! Get away from it! Partner! Call for SWAT! Tell them we got a barricade! We're taking fire! 
blah blah, calling that in, scanning windows, scanning doors. Oh, they're trying to talk to him, trying to get him to listen. I'm thinking I'm going to fly. I told you I have to go to my house. Now get the hell out of here. Hey, buddy, are you shot? You need medical assistance? Let's get an ambulance on the way. We've got SWAT on the way. You're going to have to kill me. I'm not surrendering. Hey, Sheriff, who was already here, is there anyone else in the house? I'm going to be proning out now. We're going to wait for SWAT. Shit. He died quickly. and that was crazy fun tons of scenarios here so mike as my instructor today is going to go ahead and uh, kind of critique me how'd i do professor you you did really well um i mean you really you blew it out of the water um, because we don't get clients of your caliber in here um, a lot of the things that you did great on was really movement uh, your movement for <laughs> maybe that's five dollar bills it's 20. Uh, no, your movement was great, um, you're on target, you know, because you train all the time, your response in the simulator is better than most of our clients that we get. Our clients that we get have never been through, even thought about being in these situations, and when they get in it, their brains lock up, and they make the mistake of just putting one round on a target instead of multiple rounds on a target to ensure that that threat's um, out of, you know, it's just done. Um, in this case, you, your, your shots were dead on target. You moved well. We had some collateral damage. Uh, <laughs> uh, so with that, though, you know, again, it comes with doing this multiple times and I, train, you know. It's, ir train. it's irritating because I'm still thinking about a few scenarios where I totally died, like hardcore died. Yes. Some dude shooting and I hear the shots. I just can't find him. I'm like, oh, there he is. And by the time you find him, I've gotten shot like 12 times. He's impossible little tiny angle down by a desk all the way to the far right screen and you just be like ah so this is the guy that's been killing me for two minutes <laughs> so yeah not uh not fun there what else anything no um again you did really well um it, again it, this is about bringing having our clients coming in and doing this multiple times to build that level that you're at so that when a threat does um, present itself they're able to again think fast or see fast and think fast. That's great. So you're there. Thanks. When I first started running these scenarios, I've been playing with simulators for four or five years or so. I mean, just lots of times buying simulators. But man, holy cow, the uh, learning curve was really steep. I made so many mistakes and just not really knowing the legalities and understanding exactly when to draw and where to move and it's just it was a completely different context for me for military. So I, I had to learn a good bit right there and uh, uh, anyway, all, all, a lot of times threat focus of like this guy's the problem, but you got to keep an eye on this one. And as soon as you think see lethal force here, it's so easy to just have all your vision just go right here. And so, man, tactical tunnel vision is such a killer on a battlefield. So uh, anyway, that's some stuff that you might be surprised you got to work through if you find a simulator. But find a simulator, get training, and if you're in the southeast, links below. Uh, check these guys out. Michael's a good dude. So uh, thanks again, man. Yeah, Appreciate absolutely. It. Yeah. Thanks for seeing. See you next time, guys. And that is the video. Thanks so much for tuning in, everyone. Remember to subscribe, comment, like, all that stuff is fantastic. Thank you, Sportsman's Guide, for sponsoring this video. And everyone out there, train hard, train smart, and we'll see you next time.